Well, here at KXLY4, we've seen our share of anchors and reporters over the years, and tonight we're remembering a man who once occupied this anchor chair. He died covering the news in 1978. KXLY4's Melissa Luck has a story of former KXLY reporter Cole Bunzel, honored this month for his dedication and sacrifice. At the museum in Washington, D.C., a wall honors the men and women who have died bringing the news to the world. 2,156 journalists from every corner of the globe. Mother's Day weekend, they added a name from right here in Spokane. He lived for the big story. 1978 in the United States, Cole Bunzel. Cole Bunzel was a reporter and anchor at KXLY. On January 12, 1978, he was heading to Pullman to cover then Vice President Walter Mondale. He was one mile south of Spangle when he hit a tractor trailer head on. He died at the scene. It was one day after his 25th birthday. Probably the worst day of my broadcasting career, 21 years, and probably for just about everyone in that newsroom too, to live through that day, to have to put together and go on the air that night and, and do the news. And here I am 34 years later and the emotions still, uh, still are there. 34 years later, two of Cole's KXLY colleagues came to honor him as his name was added to this wall. They were joined by Cole's three brothers and his mom. This Mother's Day, it was mother honoring son. It's not just a Hallmark Day anymore. It's a special day. And I'm glad I'm alive to be here. Cole's broadcast career may have been short-lived, but he's now forever remembered at a place that honors the giants in our field. To the world, he's now one of more than 2,000 who gave his life in service to the public. To his family and the men and women who worked beside him, he'll always be remembered as a brother and a friend. Cole's come to a place in, on that wall and in this museum uh, where his spirit and, um, and what he meant to, I think, his family and his colleagues can be exhibited in the, in the bright sun, and it's a, it's a good day. I'm Alyssa Lutt, KXLY4 HD News. Wow, great story. Yeah, touching story. Thanks a lot, Melissa.